That's pure shockwave jackhammer performance that you can't get from a gang machine. All right, guys, so today we're running the Salford 4200. This field was wheat, really good wheat at that. And then uh, they covered it today with turkey litter and they wanna use the 4200 to do mainly two things, incorporate that litter and then also do kind of a finish smoothing path. Now it is extremely dry, it's hard, it's late August. These are some of those toughest conditions uh, to be running a tillage tool in. But we're gonna turn this camera around, we're gonna get out the handy dandy knife, do some digging and show uh, what we're seeing here with the 4200. All right, so we're out here and we're gonna do a little bit of digging with the uh, Leatherman. I kind of cleared out an area here already, uh, but I mainly want to show you guys the fracturing that we always talk about. And uh, there's there's a lot to, to see here. You know, on the surface, we're doing a lot of bearing, a lot of it mixing and incorporating, uh, but below the surface, we're doing just as much work. And I want to show you guys, we always talk about the fracture, but I want to try and really hone in on some of this fracturing that I'm that we see. Um, if we just kind of chip away at the knife, what happens is you'll see the areas of the dirt around the knife move. And that is from the blades coming in here and doing that jackhammer effect that I always talk about. Now this tool is spaced every five inches. There's a blade, which means there is a gap in between blades where there would be what some call a column, okay? And we can find some of those with this tool, but the difference is, is that because of our jackhammer, we're blowing that column out. So if we get to an area, like right here, I think there was one, and I stick my knife in there and just lightly pry, it comes right apart blows apart blows apart just completely shatters just flicking it apart in that ground it's like it it had shock waves running through it that's exactly what we're after and if we come over here and keep digging to try to find a column or something similar right here is is a good example get your knife in there look at that that whole zone is just fractured and blown apart and that's what we're looking for we're using those front concave blades to mix the dirt and then we're using those rear straight eight wave large coil blades to really do our jackhammering and it's just so impressive not only that it does that jackhammer i mean look at that stuff's just blown apart but what is unique is how deep this stuff goes we're only running this tool probably four inches because it's so hard but just right now i mean look at this see if you can see that let me do it right here can you see that whole area moving Look at that. That's pure shockwave jackhammer performance that you can't get from a gang machine. What the independent blades do, it's what's below the surface. It's what you can't see with the naked eye. You know, for a long time, people would watch Salford's run and on the surface, some of those models, they'd say, ah, oh, it's not doing enough work. It's doing plenty of work. It's doing more work than any adjustable gang machine could do because it's doing the soil fracturing. It is, I mean, look at that. It is just blowing this stuff apart and that is the whole concept. That right there is what we always talk about. Look at this, let me make sure I got this in view. And I just dig and I just broke apart that whole stuff by barely flipping on it. And you just go around and start poking and all of this stuff 
it's like you dropped a bomb on it. It is just completely broken apart. And that's what I want you guys to see and I want you to realize. You know, imagine what this does for water infiltration. Imagine what this does for root development and root growth. I mean, we're six inches deep here and the tool's only going three. You just keep digging and, and chipping away and pretty soon you realize that not only did we mix and flip and bury the residue, but we created shock waves that went down and out across this entire field. And uh, that is what the secret behind the Salford is. And I've done a bunch of these videos over and over and over. You run a Salford, you're gonna have that shock, that blow apart action. And that's what I'm trying to portray in this video is just simply how easily this stuff just blows apart and crumbles. And that, that is what you can't see from the surface. You can't see it from the tractor cab. You get out and dig, you get out the planter. Look at that. That whole, that whole thing was just fractured by a blade running through here at nine miles an hour. Look at that whole dirt area just blowing apart. I'm not in Illinois. Look at that. We're easily six inches deep here. It's just blowing it apart. Right there you can actually see, ah, oh, it got covered up. You could actually see a fracture line right there. Look at that. That right there is a fracture line. I don't know if you can see it. Right there is where a blade came through and actually hit this dirt and fractured it. And you, you could see that kind of lightning bolt of energy get blown down through there to break up and crumble this. It's late August. It's dry. It's hard. And we're able to do this stuff with the performance of that tool right there.